Well, investing in the future, that's what Detroit's Tuskegee Airmen National Museum is doing with a new $500,000 grant from the FAA. Tonight, our Megan Woods takes a closer look at how that money is being spent to make dreams come true for local high school students. Megan? Yeah, Christy, Kimberly, alumni from this program have gone on to become military pilots, airline pilots, drone pilots, engineers, and this $500,000 grant will help expand their reach and bring more diversity into this industry, just like the Tuskegee Airmen did all those years ago. If they can do it, you can do it. In fact, they're standing by hoping you will do it. That's what this program was founded on and what the young people who participate hold on to. By the age of four, I knew about them. They're my favorite people to learn about in history. Why? They look like me. They flew for their country and they flew because they liked it. John Dillegard started in the museum's program in 2016. In the fall, he's studying history and aeronautics at Liberty University. One of many full circle moments, museum president and CEO Brian Smith cherishes. We actually have fewer African-American pilots today than we did during World War II. And when you talk about the aerospace industry, even fewer still. The museum is currently training 20 children and next class will have 30. We want to reach more young people and this grant will help us do that. We're looking for students in high school, of high school age, and people of color in the metro Detroit area. Because it's not enough just to know incredible history. It shows that we can make black history even in March, outside of February. This program wants children to recognize it's in arm's reach. I feel like people know about it, but they don't necessarily want to get interested in it. Or it seems like a lot of the resources are not necessarily within grasp. And if you're not familiar with this historical museum, it's in Detroit inside the Charles H. Wright Museum. And if you want to get your kids involved, because remember, they're looking for more children to participate, we'll have that info on clickondetroit.com. Back to you. All right, what a fantastic opportunity. Thanks so much, Megan.